And I can't wait till we can break apart to hear me if I seem a little unimpressed with this an antisocial pessimist. Hey guys, Mankind here bringing you episode 4 of my Trade Skill Master tutorial. Now, this video ties into episode 2 where I talk about uh, creating auctioning uh, operations and how to set up groups that way. So if you haven't seen episode 2, I will put a link for that uh, up above here so you can check that out. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to create custom groups using the TSM Group Maker on their website and how to import those groups into your TSM add-on. You may be asking yourself, well, why would I want to do that? Well, the reason is uh, if you want to get into any kind of TSM shopping or sniping, you're going to need to have these groups set up uh, with items that you don't currently have. Uh, that way you can do full scans and potentially pick up items to flip or resell. Um, and to do that, you're going to go ahead and open up your browser and go to tradeskillmaster.com. Once you're there, you're going to go to Site and click the Group Maker. Now, the way this works is we're going to go to Wowhead and we're going to pull some information from that site, paste it here into this box, and then through the magic of the internet, it's going to populate us a string right here that we can import into TSM. Uh, so go ahead and open up a new tab. I'm going to go to Wowhead. And you can do this. I'm going to show you how to create a couple groups for mounts. Um, but you can do this for anything, armor, weapons, what have you. But you're going to hover over database, the items. And there's a lot of different items here that you can use. And they're all pretty, uh, they're set up very easily to find things, what you're looking for. We're going to go with mounts, three different kinds of mounts. So I'm going to make my groups just like this. I'm going to choose mounts and ground mounts at first. Now, once you get here, you're going to see that there's 330 mounts. Now, I know there isn't 330 ground mounts that I can sell in the auction house. So, the first thing we're going to do is add a couple filters uh, right here. The first thing I want to check this box, exclude results from beta. I don't want anything from the Legion beta to show up on here. Um, add additional filters. Uh, I am going to do binds when picked up, and I'm going to set this to no. And watch what happens when I hit apply filter. That took me from 330 down to 16. Now, that seems a little bit more realistic. Now, let's see if there's any other filters that I need to do. I think that's good. Now, you can just kind of scroll down here. and All these mounts, I know I've seen all these. I know I can sell these. So what we're looking for here is a magic number of 16. Uh, so what you're going to do is, uh, right at the top here where it says name, you're going to click and drag and highlight and copy all this. And down here where you have the bottom 1 through 16, right-click, copy. Go back to the group maker, click inside this box, and paste. Now you're going to see it populated us a nice string. I am just going to highlight and copy this and go back over to WoW. And I'm doing this on a blank profile for the demonstration. I'll open up TSM groups. I'm going to make a couple groups for this. I'm just going to call it mounts. And I'm going to put a couple subgroups. Ground. So for ground mounts, I'm going to go to import slash export in this box here. You cannot right click in this box, so just control V and OK. Now you'll see that it populated all of those mounts. Now uh, look at my chat screen, let me disable my webcam. Now if you look at my chat screen, you can see successfully imported 16 items to mounts and ground. Uh, so that way we know there were 16 items there, and we successfully imported 16. We had no errors. We're good. So go back to my web browser. I'm going to hit this clear button. That's going to clear everything out. Next, I want to do the flying mounts. So I'm going to come back up to the top. You'll notice here, this is where we are. I'm going to hover over ground, and here comes the other options. I'm going to choose flying, and that should save my filters. And that's going to come up with 17 mounts that I can uh, put into this group. So once again, click, drag, highlight, and copy. Go back to my group maker and paste. And that's going to give me my string. Copy that. And back to my game. I'm going to choose uh, my flying subgroup. Import, export. 
And I'm going to paste this in here. Hit OK. And perfect. And once again, I will show you that we have successfully imported 17 items. So we know that that's right. And for the last one, I'm going to clear, go back to Wowhead. And flying, I'm going to choose aquatic. Now I already know there's only one aquatic pet that I can sell, and that's the Reigns of Poseidus. Now if you're just going to import one item, I don't need to go through the whole group maker thing. I'm actually just going to click on the item itself. And you'll notice up here in the uh, in the browser bar, it says item equal, and then it has the number. Well, that's the number I want right there, so I'm just going to copy that. Or you can remember it, 67151. Go back to the game. Choose aquatic. Import, export. You can copy it, paste it, or just type it in and press OK. And there it is. So now I have all my mounts. Now I'm all set. If I want to add some operations for selling any, selling these, if I had any, I can put a shopping operation. That way I can start skinning the auction house and seeing if somebody maybe posted these at a lot less than what they're actually worth. Maybe I want to buy them and resell them. You can do this with anything. You can do this to make transmog groups. Um, uh, profession groups, any kind of groups that you could think of in this database. There's hundreds and thousands of different groups that you can potentially make to uh, make your shopping and sniping a lot easier. But this is the bread and butter. This is where you start. Uh, that's it for this video, guys. If it helped you out, please like, share, comment, subscribe. And as always, guys, I will see you on the next one, and thank you.